At this point, we're going to bring up Mayor Latoya Cantrell. Please give our round of applause. Good afternoon. In full weeby fashion, he would bring us together for no other reason but be that of love. A true, true son of the city of New Orleans in every way. His life was a reflection of who each and every one of us, who we are as a people. And guess what? Not through anything of violence, but love. And that matters. And I love me some Weeby. I did, I loved him. And, and we would text and we would call and I would always really try to open up City Hall to the people of our city and absolutely to our culture bearers and our ambassadors who make our city what she really is. And so Weeby texts me about his song, Get Out the Way. I said, well, Weeby, come on over to the office and perform it for me so we can get it out there. And uh, he said, okay. Got his information over to Eileen Carter, who was our social media manager. And so they began to make things happen. So when I came in, because I knew I was, we was going to be at City Hall, she said, uh, Mayor, uh, we be shooting this video. I said, what? A video? And she said, yeah. And this was coming off of the weekend of where, you know, there was some uh, discussions about, because Breeze had, you know, his thumb messed up and, and discussions about, well, was Hill or was it uh, Bridgewater going to play and all this. I said, well, okay, well, Weeby's doing this video, and you know, Weeby love the Saints, right? Let's get out the way. That's what it was all about. So I said, oh, I got to get me a Bridgewater jersey. <laughs> Not even knowing what the number would be, that five, right? <laughs> and so I said, well, I need a Bridgewater jersey, and I had my people calling around, calling around, oh, no, no Bridgewater. So one of the NFL stores said, well, you know, they can custom make it for you. I said, well, I don't have time for that. Weeby has this video shoot about to happen. <laughs> and they said, well, no, ma'am, we can make it in 30 minutes. I said, well, make me one. So, and Weeby was all for it because he knew my subliminal message was give Bridgewater a shot. So anyway, we get down and I mean, the city hall, the lobby is just packed. It really is a video shoot. And I couldn't even get down, I mean, I was dancing all the way down. And then I get downstairs and see my little nephew, Jerron, who was always with his dad. And so, I mean, we went through the shoot. And of course, that was a, only in New Orleans that could ever happen in the United States of America. <laughs> only in New Orleans. So, this son of our city is our son. And we need to make sure that we keep the love going. And let's make sure that, that love truly does manifest itself into furthering the life of all of our people. But one that really does walk with Lil Jerron. And I would text Weeby, I said, Weeby, I need to talk to my nephew. Tell my nephew to give me a call. And Weeby will call me out of the blue. Hey, your nephew want to talk to you. So little nephew, I just want you to know that your auntie mayor, I'm not going anywhere. I am for you. I am for you. And I love you. I really do. 
and know that the city of New Orleans loves Weeby as well. Yes, so God bless the family. Yes, that's right, that's right. Looking like your daddy. And look, you, got, you don't have your shades on now. But Mama Janice, listen, I told you earlier, we will continue to lift Weeby up in this city. And we will do that through that spirit of love because he loved us and he was a light for this city. Man, you can't make it up. God bless you and may, may our son rest in God's perfect peace. Amen. I love you. I love you.